Okay, now I'll start planning to make my commentary. Okay, now, so here we got Mama Duck and four babies, and we got Papa Duck and maybe Uncle Duck, which is unusual, too, because normally what I've seen down here is that there's always a, a second male around. Yeah. And not after the first day. The first 24 hours, no, after the mating, the, the other Papa Duck won't allow the Uncle Duck around. But then after that, the next day, 48 hours later, then Uncle Duck is around, allowed to be around. And uh, so here's four little babies, and I don't know if these are the four, but this is a delayed process. So this took like 30, what did I just say, 31 days or whatever it was. It was 26, 20, oh, 33 days, maybe 33 days for these to hatch. And so if those are the ones that hatched over here, there weren't as many as there should have been. There should have been about eight or maybe nine. And so only four survived the delayed hatching process. And but there they are. Or maybe that's them, I don't know, because there's been a bunch. There have been four yesterday that I videotaped, and then there, and I didn't get the ones Tony saw two days ago, So, they're, but they're all different. And there's a, a picture of a pigeon down there, too. Oh, now we got three males. Now the males are after Mama. Yeah, yeah, this is, yeah, the males, the males know that Mama just, just hatched those ducks, so she's ready to be impregnated again, and they're all after her. And here's three, three males now. So now we're going to see a, maybe a fight. One of these males is going to get in a fight with the papa deck that's going to chase one of those other decks away. And I'll see. And they'll swoop down on Mama. Yeah, Mama's going to circle around and come back or something. Oops, I'm getting too high here. I'm not getting to get control my angle. This is going to be a long damn video. I usually don't want to take them this long. And the pause on this camera doesn't work that great. In other words, I can't just pause it and then start retaking. I have to take a separate video right each time. But, okay, there's those little babies. But anyway, so the, the test, now yesterday, see, two of the little ducks from the two yesterday stayed on my side of the, of the uh, walkway. And then the other ones were with Mama on the other side. And I was talking to him. I mean, as soon as I see him, I talk to him all the time. So I don't know, I, I have yet to prove whether they recognize voices too while they're in the egg. In other words, if they can, they can hear the voice this far up from way down there in an egg and then recognize that voice after they're hatched. That'll take a couple of years to prove something like that. But people that have ducks, I mean, because there's people that have little ducks that, I mean, they're around all the time. You know, they don't disappear. They have them in the backyard, the damn ducks, you know, they stay there. But these in San Antonio, they disappear. They all disappear. And I've, there, there's been over 100 little ducklings so far since I've been here, November. And they're all disappeared. And I haven't seen them since. They come back as soon as they get bigger. Yeah, well, I want to see them when they're young. I want to see a young duck. And now, two of the orange-billed ducks I saw yesterday were were fairly small, and I assume they're young. And I was thinking, well, maybe the orange-billed ducks are the ones. But that's kind of weird because if the if the orange disappears and they become regular-colored ducks, then that would really be strange. Yeah, they're just all over the place. One little duck on its own, and <laughs> they're cute. I like those yeah, ducks. Yeah. I like the little duckies. Yeah, okay, well, 